So our unique approach to building this robot involves a design strategy in which we treat the robot's structure as a variable. So adaptive morphogenesis is the idea that the robot's body is made of all these components and that we can treat those, which are normally fixed materials, as mutable as well. So we can change the structure of the robot as well as the way it's moving and interacting, interacting with the world. So the unique morphology changing nature of our robot will allow it to perform tasks that require any sort of adaptation. I think it can really help in jobs like environmental monitoring, for example, of an estuary system where the robot would have to go between patches of land and patches of water and transition back and forth to survey and take data. Another potential use case is, for example, support of divers. So the robot could transport materials or tools from the land to a submerged job site where divers are working. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.